I live really close to Garrett now. I live in the same neighborhood, so it's easy to uh, kind of go and throw whenever each person has the time. Um, don't really have to drive anywhere. And um, we went out to the complex a couple times a week to throw bullpens and live bullpens. Um, but, you know, workouts, we were kind of on our own for workouts. We had our own group. But, uh, you know, it was nice to, to have the ability to do that um, in Arizona and, uh, you know, stay ready for the season in case it did happen. Um, you know, it is kind of tough being on, on the edge right there, not knowing uh, when or if it is even going to happen. But um, I think both of us had had an idea of where we needed to be and, uh, you know, what we needed to keep ourselves at in between um, the stoppage and then uh, the season coming up. Uh, it is pretty different just because there's no crowds there. There's, uh, you know, the, the level of excitement comes from the players and, and doesn't really start with the fans at this point um, like it would in a normal season. Uh, but, you know, it, it's baseball again. Everybody's excited to be out on the field. And um, I think once we start seeing other teams, it'll be a little bit different. It'll, the, the uh, you know, competitiveness will come out even more just because, you know, the season's coming up and, uh, you know, it's a shortened season too. So we know that it's going to take from game one until game 60. So um, I, I think the stadiums, you know, whether they will have fans or not, I think um, we're getting used to it and it won't quite really be a factor at the end. It is going to be nice to throw against some new guys. Um, you, you find that kind of fine line of um, your own teammates, you know, you want to be careful, you know, it's scrimmage games. Everybody's got to be ready for the season and nobody wants to get hurt in these kind of scenarios. Um, but it is going to be a lot better to be pitching against somebody who's not on my own team. Um, but, you know, I, I don't really have any concerns. I, you know, I've, I'm pretty much a homebody. I'm, I'm, you know, away from the crowds a lot. And even at the stadium, you know, making sure to keep your distance and, uh, you know, be aware of what's going on in the world. Um, but I think this entire group here has kind of felt that way. You know, the only po we only had one or two positive tests coming in um, and, and have continued to test negative throughout uh, the time here. So I think everybody has uh, a good understanding of what's going on and, and they're being smart about it. Personally, I think my mindset doesn't change. My game plan won't change. Um, you know, you, you might be a little bit more focused on each and every pitch um, that much more because you know your time is limited. Um, but I think everybody is aware of, uh, of the way the season is going to work this year. Uh, you know, there will be some uh, roster moves or changes that, you know, you're not like expecting, but, um, you know, it's very possible with only a 60 game season. So, I think guys are prepared to to go out there when when their name is called and um, be ready to pitch uh, or hit whatever the case may be, and uh, you know be used in in the way that the manager and, and the front office sees fit. For me, is what I notice is kind of work ethic and um, you know the time that they put into their craft and and what they're doing here. Which um, you know from an organizational standpoint, it seems like that's been taught early on and and you know kind of hounded on because. A lot of the guys here are, are here to work and, um, you know, they're, it, it's impressive to see the routines that they've already established. Um, obviously, it's going to change over time and they're going to get used to kind of how their body works and um, the way that they play and, and prepare for games. But, um, you, you know, the work ethic, the, the time in the weight room, the time getting their bodies ready and um, the time that they spend on the field has been impressive.